welcome to the Mountain Morning Show. Sitting here with Olympic freestyler Shannon Barkey. Thanks so much for being in studio. Thank Love you. the Rosignol zebra. Thank you. I know I'm ready for winter. Like, Are you? Fall is hit and winter is almost here. Okay, so Shannon, let's ask you this. Dane, no whoop whoops <laughs> from the crowd. Stop that right now. Shannon, are you okay with the season lasting until July 4th? No. Okay. I am not even Dane Craig, one did you hear that? Bit. Because I am totally cool until the resorts close and then it's kind of like, let's bring on summer, right? Yeah, I mean, I, I love mm -hmm. all the seasons here. That's why I Park agree. City is so amazing. We can do everything. Yeah. So I really like my summers. So as much as I am ready for winter, I really don't feel like we got, um, you know, a great, great <laughs> summer. So totally agree. <laughs> kind of tiptoeing in. <laughs> I agree. We're both kind of tiptoeing in too. Now, Shannon, you obviously recognize her even without the pink. If we say the pink, you know, you may recognize her even more. But, you know, back in 2002, it was silver medal, right? Uh -huh. Here yeah. in, uh, and then in Vancouver, it was bronze medal that yeah. you picked up. So congratulations for that. Thank but you. you. You stay very uh, much so in the public eye because you're always doing stuff with like the coffee shop down in Salt Lake. Now you're doing this fast and female park city so you're involved in a lot of stuff which we love seeing with our Olympic athletes so let's really talk about this fast and female park city though what it is for the girls well, basically, it is. Um, it was an organization started by um, an Olympic gold medalist up in Canada to really inspire, motivate, you know, get women active, and right. that's something that I'm so passionate about because I feel like, you know, there's not enough of that in our country. So it's something that I'm really, really excited about. Um, and they do events all over North America, and this is the first time that Park City is ever going to host the event. That's so exciting. it's really, really cool. There's only 150 girls that are allowed to do it, so people need to sign up. Now, what are the girls doing? Because it's in, when is the date again? It is October 8th. October 8th. So you're going to be doing dryland training. Yeah, um, we're going to have a bunch of different stations set up. There's over 20 Olympians and U.S. team members from speed skating, um, snowboarding, mm -hmm all kinds of athletes that are here cool. up in Park City and Salt Lake. And so we're going to have different stations, um, whether it's dry land training, um, doing inspirational talks, just kind of get women excited nice. about, you know, getting outside, getting active and healthy. No, and I think that's probably the big point you're trying to drive home, as opposed to we're really trying to get them to be the next Olympic athlete, right? Mm -hmm. I mean, great, if that happens, fantastic. Yeah. But the idea behind this is to get people out. And in a place like Park City, Utah, how can you not want to go out? I, I mean, know, we all, I'd I know. say pretty much everybody lives here because they want to. It's not a place most people live here because they're forced. Yes. Because we want to be in the outdoors. <laughs> we want to live a good lifestyle. And we love it here. We love the seasons. So if you are wanting to get your, uh, you know, the girls involved in this, what ages can they be to participate in this? Um, for this event, it's going to be from 9 to 19, and they can register online at fastandfemale.com. Now, so. it might be a little bit intimidating. I'm always totally freaked out when I'm on the mountain and there's Olympian next to me or something, and they're like, you're going to see on camera scary, I with so-and-so today. I'm like, uh-uh, uh-uh, I can't do it. Because I get totally freaked out because you guys are amazing. So for these girls who, you know, maybe want the inspiration to get out at a young age, whether, you know, they're 9 years old or they're 19, um, you know, do they have to be super competitive? Do they have to be the greatest athlete in their, you know, their grade? Or no, what are you looking no. for? No, We just want girls to get out and have fun. Mm -hmm. We live in one of the most amazing places in the entire world. We have access to Olympic athletes, to, you know, U.S. US team members that are, you know, moving up. Mm -hmm. But more importantly, we have this great outdoors. Right. And so to get girls excited about that and recognize that you don't have to be the best in the world to get out and be active, that you can go out and do it for fun. Mm -hmm. So bring all your friends and, and come together and meet people. I think that that's another thing that I'm really excited about is when you have friends and you know that they're active and you want to go for a hike or play soccer or learn how to ski, right. to have that group of friends around you, that's really, really what I I am passionate about and I think that this event is really going to help girls do. And sometimes you need the girls to call you up and say, hey, we really need to go for a run. And I you're know. like, oh, okay, <laughs> I'll stop eating the popcorn and I'll go with you, right? I know. Well, there's been so many times, you know, whether it be when I was training or now mm -hmm. just getting out and doing something. If you have a group of girls to go out there mm -hmm. with and motivate each other, it's all the better and you have more fun. Cool. Okay, so the website they can go to is just fastandfemale.com. Yes. So go there and then there's links to that where you can find the Park City registration. Get your girls signed up. Like Shannon said, there's only 150 slots. It's October hurry, hurry, hurry. 8th. So get those. These girls are going to be with, I mean, go look at the list of names uh, that these girls will be with. Athletes from, like you said, all different genres, and it's just yep. so cool that they're going to be right there. You know, it's, I always joke, but I always say that, you know, you're walking down Main Street and you run into these Olympic athletes, and you guys are our Hollywood. <laughs> you don't know about that. Oh, but... Stuff, but you are. They're always humble about it, but you'll see them and you're like, 
wait a second, I just saw you. Like, you, <laughs> you see them, and it's pretty cool that they're here in our backyard. Check it out for the ladies, fastandfemale.com. Shannon, so good to see you. Thank you. So Thanks nice for coming in. On. Thank you. Absolutely. All right, we are going to take a short break here on the Mountain Morning Show. Stay with us. We're about 22 minutes past the hour. We're going to be doing a little cooking here in just a little bit, and a lot more coming up right after this. Stay with us.